Eric and the Lyle Menendez are facing the prospect of a resentencing, but not everyone wants them out of prison. Sharon Osborne and Jack shared, while on a walk in Los Angeles on Tuesday, October 29th, that they do not believe Eric, 53, and Lyle, 56, deserve to have their life sentences, without the possibility of parole, reconsidered. When asked by the outlet if she was for or against it, Sharon, 72, told the cameras, I'm against it because they killed their parents. A reporter for the outlet then noted how the Menendez brothers, who have seen renewed interest in their case, a result of the Netflix series Monsters, and the network's documentary, the Menendez brothers have received global compassion as a result of the alleged molestation they endured. Sharon's son, Jack, 30, said in response, If it did happen, it sucks and it's terrible. A uh, shotgunning your parents in the face numerous times before his mom offered further thoughts. I put it this way, Sharon told the outlet, if they could have had the where with all up here points to head the plan to murder their parents, why didn't they have the where with all to leave? The reporter then pointed out to the Osborns how Eric and Lyle's situation has been compared to battered woman syndrome, otherwise known as intimate partner violence, which Medical Mustadi states a, a psychological condition that can develop when a person experiences abuse usually at the hands of an intimate partner. It's not the only time in recent months that the Osborne family have shared strong opinions on current news. Sharon recently shared a tribute to Liam Payne, who died on October 16th at the age of 31, while accusing the music industry of failing the musician. Sharon was a judge on The X Factor, the British talent show that developed One Direction for seven years, and has worked in the music industry since the 1970s, originally as manager to her husband Ozzy Osbourne. Liam, my heart aches, she wrote via Instagram on October 18th. We all let you down. Where was this industry when you needed them? You were just a kid when you entered one of the toughest industries in the world. Who was in your corner? Rest in peace, my friend. Ozzy, 75 also made headlines when he apologized to Britney Spears during the July 30th episode of the Osborns podcast for criticizing the singer's dance moves. While Sharon and Jack do not share sympathy for the Menendez brothers, who were convicted in 1996 of murdering their parents Kitty Menendez and Jose Menendez in 1989. Many celebrities are in favor of their release Sonny Hostin, Rosie O'Donnell, Gypsy Rose Blanchard and Kim Kardashian are just a handful. Los Angeles District Attorney George Gaskin announced on October 4th that a hearing for Eric and Lyle Menendez has been set amid new evidence. Gaskin requested on October 24th during a press conference that the brothers be resentenced. And on Tuesday, October 30th, the brothers' lawyer, Mark Giragos, revealed he is planning to request clemency for them off California's governor, Gavin Newsom.